I decided to go do a little fossil hunting after work. Uh, I'm out here in a clearing for new housing. It's in the Duck Creek Fort Worth Formation. Look what I found. Big giant echinoid. Alright, let's see if we can get this out. Dirt's very hard. Good. Oh, I need a stick to dig it out some more. Okay, no stick, but I did find a rock with a sharp corner on it. Let's try this. Okay. Uh -huh. well, pretty good, I guess, for a giant one. Nice. Here's a pretty good echinoid. Has really good detail. It should clean up pretty good. You see these all the time in the Fort Worth Formation, these tubes. What these are is fossil burrows. It's burrows that have been infilled and then they solidified. I was looking at this, I noticed over here is a very nice echinoid. Let's try to get this one out. I think I can just pull it out this way. Yep. Oh, that's a good shape. It looks better when I clean it up. Nice. Oh, yeah. It's a whole aster. One of the things that helps tell us we're in the upper Duck Creek Formation is the presence of these little shells. These are actually brachiopods. They're not clams. Uh, brachiopods have a totally different internal anatomy. And this is an index fossil for the upper Duck Creek Formation. And here's something you see, you see, little pectin shells in association with all these brachiopods. Look at that. There's a whole nest of them all over the place. Nothing but brachiopods. <laughs> 